What's going on guys, it's Garb Nation back again with another Realm of the Mad God video. Today we'll be taking a look at a new insane DPS set for the Bard, that even out damages other bow classes. Now make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and without further ado, let's get into it. Now for the bow, I highly recommend using the Doom Bow, which is a rare white bag drop from the Undead Lair. Although you could use a Leaf Bow or a Coral Bow, I like the Doom Bow the best for this set because the Bard has a high dex, so the Doom Bow's slow fire rate isn't affected very much. Also, with how much attack you have, the Dumo regularly hits for 800 to 900 damage. For the loot, I think that the Wavecrest Concertina is easily the best option. This drops from the Deadwater Docks is a rare white bag drop. It is sort of like a poison that throws parrots that do 200 damage a second. But the most important thing about this item is that it gives plus 4 attack and plus 4 dex. For the robe, the Toga Picta is a must. This robe drops from the Undead Lair, so you could farm for this while you are farming for the Doombo. Now this robe is easily one of the best in the game because it gives you a plus 8 attack. Now it does give you minus 3 dex, but we are not worried about that because of how high the Bard's base dex is. Lastly, for the ring, I would use a Bracer. This item is a very rare drop from the Shatter's first boss. It gives you a plus 6 attack and plus 6 death stat bonus along with some health and mana. I understand that this item is very hard to obtain, so I think a great substitute would be a pyramid ring. Now that's the set, let's get into some gameplay. Okay, so as you guys can see, I've been grinding out that last star for white star on the bard. And here's the set. It gives you plus 18 attack, so which puts you at 73. It also puts you at 71 dex as well as 55 speed, so that's pretty good for movement. Okay, I can finally teleport, but look at how fast this Doombo shoots with 73, or 73 attack and 71 dex. It literally seems insane. Just look at it. It's almost one-shotting these gods. And you can throw in the loot there too, so it's really good for god walls. Okay guys, I think I'm just gonna do this UDL here. I almost would recommend like a coral bow for clearing these out, but the new bow still is not bad. Okay, now we're at boss and I'll just spam a ton of poisons in there. See he Septavius moves a lot, so I wouldn't say that this is the best loot for this dungeon. But like if you got it in a snake pit, it would be very good. Or anything where the boss is not moving. Okay guys, that's going to be it for the video. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I put a little bit of extra footage. Just so uh, you can see a little bit more of the set. But uh, catch you guys next time.